Hey, Mitch Taylor here with Jeff Scott Gould today on our Five for Live Midwest DJs Live. Kind of sneak peek at some of our presenters, our sponsors. In fact, today's Five for Live is sponsored by our friends at Promo Only. And I'm joined today by Jeff Scott Gould. Jeff, thanks for being here. What's up, man? How's it going? Hey, man, it's it's great. Thank you for being a part of Midwest DJs Live. Thank you for joining me today uh, on the call. Appreciate you being a part of this. So tell us, give us a little bit of background because, I mean, Jeff Scott Gould is, is one of those names that if you know, you know, and you know the, <laughs> the absolute just phenomenal stuff you put out, but maybe you don't know. Tell me about Jeff Scott Gould. Yeah, so uh, I'm a Jersey boy, born and bred. Um, I work for the SC Event Group. Uh, so, you know, Jason J and I, who owns that company. Uh, we have a, a pretty cool company where everyone in the group kind of supports each other. We all put something into the pot to make the uh, wheels turn. And uh, my end, I do a lot of media stuff. Um, we come up with a lot of concepts and I, I kind of shoot it, edit it, deliver it, that kind of stuff. Um, I mean, I started way back. Um, I've been DJing a long, long time. I always tell people, so if you don't, if anyone doesn't know me, I come from a super large family. Um, I'm one of 10, right? Which is nuts. <sighs> So I always say that my house was Sirius XM before Sirius XM existed. You know what I mean? Like we had a second floor with like, like six bedrooms, bunch of us shared whatever, but you'd walk to a different bedroom and you'd hear rock, disco, like oldies. Like, and then what I, you know, I was into like hip hop. And so I didn't even know I was being like groomed to like, you know, music was come from every different angle. Yeah. Um, and then when I went to cook at this restaurant, I cooked for like nine years and that restaurant was owned by uh, Amelia Earhart's mechanic, right? This also, I heard, right, crazy, right? Dude, there's like six degrees of Kevin Bacon stuff. And I heard nothing but big band music. That's all they played. Like, you know, exactly. So I didn't need, so I went to go do my first wedding. I was like, oh, I know this. Oh, I know this. Oh, I know this. Oh, you know what I mean? So, I mean, I guess I, I always, I just love music from that. Um, I have two degrees. I went to college twice and I just, this was always my passion. So I always tried to go this way, came back, always tried to go this way, came back. Um, mm-hmm. And I just think media, you know, just what a, what a picture can do, what, what a piece of video content can do, a story it can tell without you even putting a caption. Like that always amazed me. It always intrigued me. It was always like, you know, like I always had like a love for it. Um, and I've always just carried it to what I, you know, to what I did. So like now, now I just, you know, over the years, you know, just learning from people in the industry um, how I, I went through a different couple different companies and just people I've met over the years. Just, it was just crazy. Just, um, you know, just, I absorb all this stuff. And then I just try and take that and put it into content that makes sense for our brand. Now, that was a long winded answer. <laughs> no, that, no, that's a great answer. I mean, you're going to be doing a seminar on exactly that. Yep. You know, we're, we're getting the expert delivering his expertise at the show, content capture and creation. So we're, we're covering the literally behind the camera and a little bit of the creating side too. It, you got 45 minutes, my friend. Like, I, can you give us a little sneak peek here of, of how you're going to pull that together and give us a nugget or two? Well, the good thing is I'm from Jersey, like the New York area. So we talk fast. That's yes. just the way we are. So yeah, so people are going to have to keep up. Like, that's just my energy. I'm, I'm just a hyper dude. So I can squeeze a lot of information. And, you know, you know, you watch someone like a Gary V and like if what he can do in two minutes, your head spinning, you know, uh, I mean, I'm not a Gary V and I'm not, I mean, I, I don't know. I'm not, I wouldn't say like they have an expert or whatever, but like, I, I think we bring some pretty cool stuff to what we do within our field. Um, and I think it's kind of important like what you do before you post it somewhere, you know? And uh, to me, I'm always all about sharing. You know, I just feel like the more we share in the industry, the better we do. And I'd rather lose an event because someone likes someone else's personality because they vibed as opposed to like, you know, I could do for this, you know what I mean? The better we, right. the better we do for each other, right? It just raises, you know, you like it raises, raises that, that, that bar, you know? So I'm, I'm all about sharing. And I would love to see people take something I have and, you know, do something 10 times more than what I did with it so I can learn from that. You know, cause you know, everything, everything in the world has been created already. You know, it's just like, it's how you interpret, it's how you make it your own. You know, so I just, and everything I, I do is the stuff I've learned. You know, I, I don't think I'm coming up with anything new. I just figured out a way to make it, you know, JSG, a way to make it SCE stuff, you know? Well, and you're, you're taking your personality and putting your spin on it. And that's the beautiful thing. Uh, is there one specific like tip you want to share with people, what they might 
uh, get at your seminar or a reason to, to come see you, what they're going to achieve with, with working for you well, there? Well, I mean, I'm going to kind of open up my my book of apps and software and stuff I use, which I think is good. Like, because, and, and it's funny because a lot changed between, you know, we had to reschedule this. So yeah. now there's a lot, there, there's apps I'm not using anymore just because technology moved forward. Yeah, yeah, and, yeah. but I just think there's stuff like that. I mean, like for an example, this app called Over, you know, it's kind of like a Canva you know, so if anyone, I'm sure a lot of people have heard of Canva because yeah. it's been coming up a lot of streaming stuff. I use Over. I like it. It's a great thing. You can create stuff without being a, a graphic design person. You can pull from so many different things. Uh, I know, you know, Nate Nelson, he's a big fan of that as well. Jordan Marshall uses it, you know, but there's other apps I'm going to use just like how you can shoot a raw image straight from your phone, you know, like and raw versus JPEG, like, you know, stuff like that. So, I mean, I just want to open up my software, like what I use for streaming because anything yeah. I can do to help everyone out, you know, I'm all about that, you know? Cool. Cool. So we're excited. If you have not checked out this man on his socials, on SCE, like, trust me, you got to see the magic that is absolutely created when JSG gets behind the camera and also behind the decks in regards to putting the video together. I mean, this man is just fire. So uh, Jeff, thank you so much. Uh, where, where can people reach you, by the way? Let me let me get you. I, I guess at Jeff Scott Gould. You know, I mean, I I live my life on IG, and I use Linktree, and that's another thing too, like using Linktree. Uh, you're something inside your thing. You can send people out to your entire world. Everywhere. So I just give one handle. From there, you can see everything else. You know. Perfect, perfect, Jeff. Yep. Thank you for being a part of this. Greatly appreciate, it, my friend. So glad. Yeah, dude. Looking welcome. forward to see you guys in, in in person. I can't wait. Right. You know, I'm excited. I know. Yeah. I'm excited to see humans. I love it. And my colleagues. I, can, I can't can wait. You. <laughs> you don't have to be through a screen. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait. I'm excited. I'm excited. Uh, we're going to have to still do the social distancing, I think. You know, we'll right. see. Yep. But, uh, but anyway, I'm excited to see you in person. Uh, Midwest DJs Live coming up in Milwaukee, April 25th to April 27th. Grab your tickets now if you haven't already done so at MidwestDJsLive.com. There are only a few tickets left remaining again this five for live is sponsored by our friends at promo only trusted by djs radio stations and entertainment venues since 1992 visit promoonly.com to get the latest hits delivered to you daily legally thanks so much for having us jeff appreciate it you got it see you guys soon <laughs>